Welcome, in front of me I have Xiaomi Smartband 10 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this smartband on the Android phone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your smartband. First thing we need to do, or rather before we start, if you want to receive the notifications uh, from your smartphone on your smartband, your band needs to be paired with your phone via the Mi Fitness uh, application. And once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we can open the Mi Fitness application on the phone that is paired with our smartband. In the app, you should see the health page. Now we can tap on device icon to open the device page. And on it, you should see your Xiaomi smartband 10. Now scroll down and find the option called notifications and calls and tap on it. And here, look for the option called app notifications. Tap on it. And if you don't have the required permissions allowed for the notifications to work, you will see this pop up on the screen. What you need to do is to tap on OK. It will direct you to this page. Here you need to find the Mi Fitness application. As you can see, I have two of them. But what you need to do is to tap on Mi Fitness, tap on the switch next to allow notification access and tap on allow. And then do the same for the second one, just in case. If you have two of them, of course, it, it might be the case that you don't. OK, and once you allow, allow them, you can uh, tap on the back button right here to go back to app. And now you can be you'll be able to enable the notifications by tapping on the switch. And here you have uh, the config for your notifications and you have options like receive only when the phone is locked, wake screen, notify only when worn. Mm. What else? We have mirror phone notifications and customized notifications. The receive only when phone is locked is basically if you enable this option and you're using your phone, the screen on your phone is unlocked, you won't be receiving the notifications on your smartband. If you disable the option, you will be receiving them anyway. So if you prefer to see the notifications on your smartband only when you're not using your phone, you can enable this option and it will uh, basically make it happen. Next, we have wake screen option. If you enable this option, it will wake up the screen on your smartband every time you receive the notifications on it. And then we have notify only when worn. So if this option is enabled, uh, notifications won't uh, pop up unless you're wearing your smartband on your wrist. And below we have more options and here we have mirror phone notifications and customized notifications. If you select mirror phone notifications, it will basically uh, apply the settings for the notifications from your phone. And the customized notifications allows you to customize it uh, specifically for the for the uh, smartband and for each specific app. And how it works is basically if you enable, let's say, notifications for Discord and you receive the notification from Discord on your phone, that notification will be forwarded to your smartband. But if you disable it, it won't be forwarded to your sm smartband. You will see it only on your phone. Okay, and once you're done with the app notifications, you can also enable the notifications for incoming calls. You can tap on it, tap on vibration, allow the required permissions, and now you, sh you should see the pop-ups on your smartband when somebody calls you on your phone. You can also ena enable the option to reply with the message. So basically quick responses. You can tap on here to customize them. You can edit them, add a new one if you want to. And next we have the uh, delay alerts. If you enable this option, it will basically delay the uh, notification on your smartband. Uh, and, it, and you can set the time fr from it goes from 3 seconds up to 30. So you can select something you like, for example, let's say 10 seconds. So the smartband will take second, uh, wait 10 seconds until it will alert me about the, the call. Okay, and at this point it should be working. So I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord. I enabled the Discord um, in the settings, so it should be working. So let me check. We're gonna send a message. And we got the notification on our phone and also on our smartband, which means it is working. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for the smartband on the uh, Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.